What is good, y'all? This is JV here, and today I got a reaction for you guys. Now, today I'm doing a reaction to a new release by Zico, Vedi Vidi Vici, or, or Vici, or something like that. He can't pronounce it, and neither can I. Um, shout out to him, though. I'm a really big fan of this latest project, and I just did a reaction to Pride and Prejudice, actually one of my favorite songs on his new album. So that should be up. Take a look at that if you're interested. And so I'm really excited to do this. And we got DJ Wagon himself, uh, who I believe is associated with AOMG, if I'm not mistaken. I might be. But from what I'm, I'm familiar with, I've bumped into a lot of his stuff on AOMG and J Park releases. So it's really cool to see them together. And this is a very powerful hype trap piece. And it's my new intro song. So uh, I'm really excited to see this music video. Finally, I know I'm late for all this and I'm um, finally able to get to it. So let's not waste no more time, let's get straight into it. Zico, Benny Vidi Vici, let's go. Starring Zico. The leg shot from the rip, wow, she's beautiful. Uh oh, y'all didn't tell me there was gonna be mixed girls up in here. Okay, chill, chill, chill. Oh, that, that hard brass intro. My God, they're good. Yo, I love me a curly hair girl. Hey, you put the lyrics in the video. That's what we're talking about. Mm. I see you with that kiss shirt, too. Ah. Great flow on this piece. Hey, you said a Taiji reference, okay. That always did confuse me, the generations of Korean hip hop, because it doesn't line up with American. Now, apparently, what, this is third generation? That's fascinating. So, what, who's first gen? Like, uh, DEF CON, P type, those days? Like Drunken Tiger and stuff? I don't know. Oh, I see you at Eminem shirt sure, too. Dope wardrobe choices in this music video. Music video definitely matching the energy and overall vibe of the piece, so I like it. it's appropriate in that regard. This is definitely like the lyrical stunt song, for sure, where he just stunts on you with all the... There's that Sour Graves reference, okay. My god, the, the little casual Korean hip-hop beats are like, so fascinating to me. Cause they're like so subtle, that you really... Like ain't nobody getting beat up or shot over it, but... It is fascinating to see them go at each other. Of the beat switch up here and oh that sharp drum hit I'm loving it mm -hmm. I love that, that how minimalistic the beat gets towards the end there and he really just keeps firing, firing, firing. He seems very hungry as a lyricist on this particular track. And I mean, you got that scratching on there, so you gotta respect the beat in that regard. That girl is absolutely gorgeous, my god. <laughs> Who is she? Yeah, only criticism I would ever have of this song, because I'm a big fan of this track, if you haven't noticed, um, is definitely just the choice in chorus, because you obviously can't pronounce that. <laughs> the, he's saying like, Weddy Weedy Weedy. Why did he choose that name then? I don't know. But yo, shout out to him. I guess because of the, the I Came, I Saw, I Conquered thing. So shout out to him, man. I absolutely love this song. Check out his newest album. I believe it's playing Royalty, or let me let me look it up because I, I want to give you guys real facts. Um, gallery, my bad. Uh, 
Chris Brown is royalty, sorry. Uh, latest release is Gallery, so check that out if you haven't thus far. It's a great album and I would highly suggest it. Great songs on it. And again, check out Pride and Prejudice reaction that I just posted not too long ago. Um, yeah, I really love that song too. Really curious as to what y'all thought, so in the comment section below, let me know what you thought about the song and the music video. Till next time, this is JV. I love you guys. Bye.